So there's two pieces of any campaign. You need to find people to, to fund it and pay for it and sponsor it, and you need people to help you engage. And sometimes those are the same groups. When we started this campaign, we created a rule where we said we don't want funds that have been given to us by communities to be what we operate. So we wanted to separate that, so we needed to go out and raise a million dollars. We needed to sell sponsorship. That took a long time, but we, we met the right people who, who believed in what we believed in. And, and one of our biggest and our presenting uh, partner was the United Association of Canada. So this is the uh, unionized pipe fitters across the country. And when UA Canada and the brothers and sisters from uh, the locals all across the country kind of came together, it was so cool because it was this unification and we had locals from every community across Canada say, you know, we want to help support you. And when I asked them, I said, well, what do you guys you know, what do you want? I'm a business guy. What, what, what do you want in return? And they said, well, we, we want you to end youth homelessness. And that's kind of all our sponsors are like that. So UA Canada, QCC, um, Walters Group, the Woodridge uh, Ford who gave us the Ford van, Fraser Way, organizations that came along to, to support us and give us that, that operating money. And when we look back, we see, you know, we thank the schools, we thank the educators, we thank the OPP. But the people who actually pay our bills to help us do the, 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 the important work that we do, that have helped us raise the hundreds of thousands that we've raised, have been our sponsors. So we couldn't do it without them. And those are the, the folks that you don't see on the side of the highway with us. You don't ne you necessarily see us walking with the kids. We're at some events with them, but they're sort of the unseen, unsold heroes of the Push for Change. We can't thank our sponsors and our financial supporters enough for helping us get through Ontario.